everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on my favorite stroller, the Uppa Baby Cruise. Now this is a Cadillac of strollers and Parker is going to be our little model today. He's all strapped in already <laughs> and I'm going to tell you why I love this so much. So at first I was going to get the Uppa Baby Vista, which is a larger model than this because it can turn into a double stroller as your family expands. But after a lot of research, I decided on the Cruise because this is lighter, it's more compact, the wheels are a little bit smaller, and it's just easier to take everywhere. But the main thing that really sold me on it was how light it is because getting it in and out of the car is not an easy task for me. So I researched so many strollers. I went to Bye Bye Baby and tested so many strollers out and this was by far the lightest. And that is what sold me on this stroller. Plus the quality. It glides, it turns, it feels like a cloud when you're pushing it. It's just so easy to push anywhere and everywhere. It is definitely durable and heavy duty and so far we are just loving this stroller. So now I'm gonna show you all the fun little details that this stroller has. So first it has this awning and it also has an extra little um, sunshade, which is nice when it's super sunny. So now you just put this back in. Hi! <laughs> now it also comes with this leather bar and um, this unzips actually, which is nice because you can take it off to clean it. Like you can see it's gotten a little bit dirty from him. He actually loves to bite this while he's teething. So that's kind of fun. <laughs> but this actually comes completely off as well. So it's nice if he's biting on this too much, I'll just take it off so that he doesn't <laughs> tear it apart. Or if he wants to see things better, I can take that off. And you can get a snack tray to put on here, but I haven't done that yet. So one fun thing about this coming unattached and attached is that I can put little toys on it. So I have this little huggable Mickey that I attach to it. We actually got this little Mickey in Disneyland Paris, Cece and I did when we went two years ago. <laughs> so he can have that to play with while he's out and about. And then I have one other stroller toy that I keep in here. It's a little rattle. It has a teether, which is nice. Yeah. And I can attach this right to it as well. So that's nice. He has some little toys that are attached right to it and keep him busy. So this is the nice basket underneath and it has pockets right in the back, which is really nice. You can actually store a drink, a water bottle, um, wallet or phone or anything in here plus the diaper bag purses blankets it's it's a nice size basket and this i added on myself it's by itsy ritzy i got this on amazon and i believe it's called like a stroller caddy or organizer or something it has this little zipper in here i could put my phone and store that i love this because it's not super big but it's just the right size so this just velcros onto the handle so it can fit a lot of different strollers and I have a large cup so I wasn't sure if it was going to fit in these types of things but it fits perfectly in here and it fits his sippy cups, uh, toys, it's just a really handy helper. And I also got just this little hook, um, I got this at Target, it's the brand Go I believe or something. And I just hook this on like this and then I can hook the diaper bag right on here so that it's super easy to get to when I'm out and about. Or I can put all of our packages when we go shopping on here. <laughs> so this comes in handy too. I really like having this attachment. So now here's the canopy and it has this wonderful little peekaboo spot where I can check on him. It has this mesh fabric here and this is magnetic, which is really nice because when I want to check on him when he's sleeping, it doesn't Velcro, so it's not making a lot of noise, so he can stay sleeping and it doesn't wake him up. So if I want to keep it up for a while, I can just roll it up and, and attach that there, and that gives him a little bit of a breeze. I can keep an eye on him 
um, if the sun's not glaring in his in the side of the stroller. Hi. Hi. He loves to look at me through this too. <laughs> Hi. So now the handle just moves easily up and down. Like for my husband, he likes it tall like this, but obviously I'm super short. So I just push this button in Aww. and it's nice and the perfect height for me. <laughs> now this little button on the back of his seat is how I move his seat up and down to recline. So I just push this button and then I can recline him all the way down or all the way up or part way down. And here's the brake right here. You just push it down to have it on and then push it up to continue strolling. Now with the brake, I know a lot of people don't like the one touch where it's either up or down um, because if you're wearing open toe shoes, it can kind of hurt to push it up. But I have to say this brake is super easy. It's just barely a flick and it will come up. So it hasn't bothered me at all when I'm wearing sandals or anything, just to kind of lightly click it up with my toes and it comes right up. So it's super easy. Now this footrest can also move. It has these buttons here. So it can go down if they're older and they wanna have their legs just down like a normal stroller, or it can go pretty much any way you want it. It can also go up for like a brand new baby. But right now we like to just leave it flat out because he likes to just have his feet kicking and going there. <laughs> now this is the seat belt and it's super easy. You just put his arms through here and click. I believe it's called a four point harness or five, actually a five point harness. So it's super easy to click everything in and then just click it undone. He's saying enough modeling for today. <laughs> I want food. <laughs> now, another reason that I chose to get this stroller is because I do not have an infant car seat. So a lot of people just use their infant car seat as, a, as an attachment to their stroller or put it right on their stroller. Um, I chose not to do that because I didn't want to have to carry the infant car seat around. Like I said, carrying heavy, heavy things is very hard for me. That's why I chose this stroller is because it is the lightest one that I could find on the market. And so I chose this stroller also because I could get an infant insert to put in here that would allow him to use it from, I believe it was four pounds and up. So that was perfect for me. I'll insert a picture of him in it when he was an infant. It's just a white insert and you can actually switch sides on it. So one side is kind of a fleecy side for winter and the other side is mesh for a cooler seat for them in the summertime. So I used the white fleecy side because he was born in October. So he was using it kind of in the colder months. Um, but that worked perfectly. It was so wonderful to use this stroller. Um, and not even have an infant car seat. We haven't missed it at all. So that was another great aspect that we loved of this stroller and purchasing it. So I wanted to show you that you can use one of these nursing covers or infant car seat covers on this stroller. I didn't know this and I saw someone else do this. And so I thought it was such a cool trick. Um, especially when they're an infant, you just kind of want to keep them covered and out when you're out in public. Okay. So, like I said, you can just put this all the way up. And it really does fit all the way around it. <laughs> he's gonna kick it down because he's kind of big to have the feet up. You can put the canopy up. And then you can e either have the hole kind of out here or or you can lift this mesh backing and have the hole on that so that you can just peek through them and get some, they can get some airflow that way. So this is really cool because I would have definitely used this when he was an infant if I had known then that you could. Um, but this is just a nursing cover by uh, Milk Snob. Now, on to talking about the fun stuff, the pandemic in the world and this stroller, how I use this stroller during the pandemic. So when I take him out, I could either use this 
uh, like I just showed you, the infant uh, cover, the nursing cover, but I know that he wouldn't like that because he wouldn't be able to see very well. So instead, I have been using the rain cover that actually came with this stroller when I bought it. Um, the Uppa Baby strollers usually come with a rain cover and a mesh cover for like mosquito covering. So I just decided to use this and let me show you, it has been perfect. Just put it on. Like this. So you can use these straps to kind of keep it tighter, but I actually like to use clothespins. <laughs> and as you can see, he likes to play with it. So I just take this and I make it really tight around the bottom. And that's what I do. And then, <laughs> are you talking? It has this little cover that I can slip little snacks into him or a passy or anything like that. So he can breathe because this does have some airflow. Um, I had a Walmart worker actually come up to me and ask, how does your baby breathe in that? Like they were really scared, but I just showed him. I said, oh, it has airflow, don't worry. <laughs> So both Parker and I love this because he can still see everything so he doesn't get annoyed or frustrated um, other than a normal baby does. But he absolutely loves this because he can still be a part of everything and see everything that's going on and I can still reach in and do things for him, help him out if he needs it. And he's still being protected, which we love. So this has definitely been our handy helper during this time, this pandemic. <laughs> So now I will show you how I put it in the car, how it folds down. So it's super easy. It has these two gray things on the sides, two little levers, and you just pull those up and it folds all by itself. And then you just pick it up, and put it in the car. So one thing is you kind of have to fold that up and it will be more compact. And then it slides in super easy. So now taking it out, it has this little lock on the side. You just undo that. And there you go. There you have her. <laughs> so now one other last thing that this stroller does is the seat comes off, not with the baby inside, and you can turn it around. And have them face you which is nice too especially when they're infants or if they're tired and they can just look at you and you can kind of close this up and keep everything kind of uh, peaceful and quiet and um, a little darker so like I said was saying the Vista up a baby stroller can turn into a double stroller so the handlebar can come out more and this seat you can buy another one and then it can have two seats or two attachments if you want to use a car seat or the bassinet. But I figured by the time that I have another baby, he'll probably be old enough to where I can get, they have like a little ride along attachment that you can put here and it's just on wheels and he can just stand on it and hold the stroller. So that's what I'm planning on doing um, when or if I have another baby. So yes, this is a very expensive stroller, even though it is less expensive than the Vista here. I definitely feel like it's worth the price. And also, I got it on the buy new or used section in Amazon. So this one was the exact color that I wanted. It's called Gregory, I believe. And I got it um, new, but in a damaged box. And so it was discounted because it had a damaged box, quote unquote, and it, was beautiful it was brand new it the box wasn't even damaged to be honest it was just brand new it had no issues and it was like forty dollars cheaper than if i were to just buy the brand new one on amazon anyways that's how i got this on such a good deal plus we signed up to get an amazon credit card which gave us a hundred dollars off on this purchase as well so i got a good deal on this and i'm so thankful and happy that i did because we absolutely love this stroller 
So now you have seen why I love this Uppa Baby Cruise stroller so much. I have so many high points that I absolutely am in love with this stroller and I definitely don't regret it. It was definitely one of the best purchases that we made and we are all enjoying it very much.